Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Thelma's Creations and More, where today I will be sharing with you the third video of the Tag Flip fall themed um, in my series, um, showing you how to decorate or what we can use to decorate tags that hopefully you all got together and did your tag basis where you took a bigger one, a smaller one, and sandwiched foam in between. To give some dimension I will be using this embellishment box that I received from my partner where um, uh, she sent me stuff um, full of fall items and I added some of my own things like I made these sunflower embellishments the videos up on my channel on build your stash and then I have bought these at um, Hobby Lobby and I added some other stuff but uh, let's see what we can do so Again, the same um, concept of taking your tag and um, making it your own is just uh, taking items that you have in your stash. I had this because I did a swap. Um, I also have these right here. I just went through my stash and got some um, items that I had. Um, what else is in here? I had I have a tutorial on my channel how to do layered embellishments. And so all I did was take some same concept as the tags take um bigger smaller i took a sticker a little um i cut apart this was on uh, project life card it had a whole bunch of words put it there i added some glitter and i made embellishments same thing right here um this one i haven't finished i need to put something there um using the same concept and it's just layering um i did this one also again there's a tutorial how to do rosettes on my channel on build your stash it shows you how to make the rosettes uh, this i punched out of a project life card that um, somebody had sent me in happy mail and then i added the detail of the glitter this one i took a an embellishment that i had made and just put it on top or hot glued it on top of a rosette. I uh, used another one of those little words from the Project Live cards. This was a sticker, again, mounted on foam. This one's on, is this on foam? No, just the acorn is on, on foam to give it more dimension and I added some glitter. So now I have this and then you play around. Would this go with it? No, because it's at the edge and you can't see that. Um, so now it's just a matter of, oh, I like that, of popping um, embellishments that I had or the flowers. Um, I kind of like that. Um, and again, um, use several layers. I have these. Are these the same? These are the same. Um, use several layers play with what you have so I don't know let's do let's go for six how about that a magic number six so I have one two three four and that's cute maybe you think it has a, a lot of orange in it four five let's see this is a piece of eyelash trim I had got on clearance at Hobby Lobby let's see how that goes I have my hot glue gun ready, that's why I have this here. Um, kind of just put it around and see what happens. Ooh, look at that. Um, the trick, I think, or at least in my case, right, I think for me, um, that I'm learning is to layer. Just put things on top of things. Oh yeah, that looks great. What do you think? So it would be one. The leaf two, the eyelash trim three, four, and the other lip five, and maybe a little bling right there. Okay, let's do that. I like that. So, let's start off right here. Put a little glue. And guys, I highly recommend this glue gun. Why? Because did you notice it didn't do me a uh, glue strings? It is a fine tip. This is a brand. I got it, or I didn't. My husband bought it for me at um, Michael's. Yeah, Michael's uh, for my birthday in April. And it has been the, the greatest thing ever, guys. You want to know why? 
because of the glue strings um, before I had a thicker I'll show it to you I have it in my filing cabinet oh my goodness <laughs> I'm known guys to throw things everywhere like I'll drop and I'm kind of nervous because I have a glass of water here let me see if I can show you the the glue gun I had before of course it's not where it's supposed to be <laughs> um anyway I used to use oh my goodness I used to use that glue gun uh, when I ran a flower shop out of my home oh many years ago um, I used to use it especially for my flower arrangements and my um, mums when I used to do home coming mums so um, I saw this lady on YouTube uh, who was it so many ladies talented and ladies and gentlemen that I watch on YouTube that um, I was wondering she was working on a project and guess what guys um, like like I'm doing now she was putting glue and she was just like touching it but she was putting lace and I'm like how can she be doing that that's crazy she must have either very calloused fingers from the hot glue gun but I've noticed that with this one I can it is warm trust me it is warm I by no shape or form um, tell you you can stick your finger in it without getting uh, burnt um, but it cools off very fast and it throws it a, a very well not a very fine line but because you control it but um, a finer line than what I had before and then look at that guys is it I think it's a he um, anyway a fine line of look look at that and you clean it off and look none every now and then when it is um, sitting there for a while and all I'm doing is I'm sorry I'm out of frame I'm putting it on top because this is gonna go here and I need to measure the other one okay it goes right there um, if it's been sitting there for a while I will get the the strings but nothing compared to before and guess what my glue sticks um, last this one has a, a foam sticker in the back so I'm gonna peel it off and I'm gonna add some hot glue here and especially right there you see So then I'm going to center it in the middle. And there you go. Isn't that beautiful? Again, let's count our layers. Uh, the tag in the back. Well, this one, right? One, two, three, four, eyelash string, five, six. And then I'm going to put a little bling, I think. Yes. Miss, uh, what was her name? The one that's, Laura. I believe it was Laura. Send me this embellishment box yeah it has to be this one oh sorry again I'm not I'm sorry guys I'm seeing which bling goes in the center of this sunflower here I think it's that one this one right here so I'll take it off and it does have adhesive in the back but I want it to stay so I'll put a little drop of glue and then I'll put it on there and that will be my seven. Oh yeah, I give it some bling. I know, I think he's a guy. I don't know, but I'm gonna give him bling anyway. Look at that. Isn't it so cute, guys? So that's one way you can decorate um, a tag. Uh, if you don't have the elements that I have, um, let me see. There's some stickers here. Uh, look at this. She gave me buttons. So let's take another one. Let's take this. Or remember I told you the regular one you know what hold on guys let me move this out of the way so that I know that I'm on frame right there will be in frame okay so uh, I'm just looking at my embellishment box to see what I can do I do have some um, embellishments that I made like this one harvest does this go here nope 
and I'll tell you why because you can't see the edge you can't see the edge of the tag and I don't like that because then it chops it off it looks orange and orange and I do not like that you know what okay. oh no 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 I have this uh, cutting board I got at the Dollar Tree so that I don't mess up my mat okay mm -hmm. nope and so it's a matter of playing around guys to see what what we want I kind of like that orange one there How about red nope. um I have this one Um, I'm playing around with items I have here, guys. Mm. So, let's see. Ooh, how about this little foxy? I like that box. Uh, what shall we put in the back? More eyelash trim? No. I don't think so. Reason? Oh, you know what? I'm going to do this. Okay, guys. This was part of my embellishment box. And... Um, I think I'm gonna put this here hanging. How about that? No, don't like it. I don't like it either. <laughs> okay, she had sent me some flowers. How about flowers? Shall we do the leaf again? Leaf on the bottom, leaf on the top. For this, for this little fox. Nah. Um, it takes you a while. This is what I I call playing around with what you got. Um, sometimes. It works out. Sometimes it doesn't. Let's go to another one. Um, mm, no, you know what? Where's that little fox? Right here. Ooh, I like that fox there. But see how we need to put something in between the fox and everything else? Hmm. So what do you have to play with? Have you got your supplies out? Is this something that I missed? What do you have? I have, oh no, no. This doesn't go there flowers I thought I had an uh, I do have one that one says fall how about this guys do you like this because I sure don't <laughs> I tricked you oh I like this how about this one welcome fall mm, perhaps oh how about this one remember the solid colored one let me show you oh yeah I like that right there welcome fall and how about we put something in the back shall we go with i have eyelash trim where did it go i have it in um yellow we already used yellow but i had it in a gold color oh this is silver oh uh, no i don't want silver I want something gold. Right? Gold would work really good. Aha, look at this. I have some of this. And this is when my table becomes messy, guys, because I'll start pulling stuff, and if I don't like it, I'll leave it there, and then at the end of the day, yeah. I like this. Okay, so I'm going to just take a strip. Ah, come on. And then I'm going to take apart the little fibers to give me some. Hey, there's just tape there. To give me some fibers. There we go. See? It's not eyelash trim, but you can still get fibers out of here. Okay, let's see. Mm, oh. How about that? Nope not happy so um ooh, how about that oh that would have made a great embellishment so the homework for today guys is for you to play with your base tags and learn to layer so take a number i'll give you a number six and put six things on it and start playing with your tags and um make a video and tag me on it below in the description box so i can start seeing your tags so this is one of my tags that I created. I can't wait to see what you do. And of course, thank you for stopping by my channel. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. And tell me, and please, please, please um, share your creations with me in the description box. Make a video and then sh uh, share the link with me so I can go see all your creations. I hope this inspires.